What's up guys, Six String Stanger. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out, guess what? <laughs> guess, can you guess? It's another Fesley. Okay, I told you we have more. This is the black one, okay? Uh, this is their dinky style type guitar. Uh, I recently did a video of the purple one. This and here's the black. Uh, I also do have the Sunburst one coming and the, what is the other? Oh, blue. I have the blue one coming too. So let's just get right into this one. And uh, let's t th this was cool. At least this was double boxed. Uh, it was double boxed because, uh, you know, it. I, I had two of them come at one time. Ah, I pulled it out and this is what it looked like right here. Right there. It's, I don't know when they lifted it up at Amazon. They probably picked it up that way and it ripped. So I don't know. I mean, the rest of it's taped up. So let's just untape it and see what we got in the box. <laughs> Okay, alrighty. So, as you can see, another beautiful case here. I do love the fact, man, you get a case with every one. And then, uh, they did the same thing here. This is, which is not a big deal, it's just kinda weird. Um, I forgot to tell you in the first one, you do get an instruction manual. Cause they like to say that this is like a be beginner type guitar, but um, this definitely could be for anybody. Uh, these guitars are amazing. Um, just an instruction booklet. Tells you what all the little bits and pieces are of the guitar. Uh, tells you how to tune it, things like that. Then you get this, uh, of course you get your Fessley strap. I showed this in the last video. It's Fessley branded. It's just a nice little strap for you. Uh, you know, if it's your first time playing, you know, or you want to get this for somebody you know. Um, cool. Ah, I don't know where my other picks went. I think I put them in the, uh, the other box. Or my other bag. <laughs> All right, just like the other one, you get your high quality instrument cable. You get an awesome clip on tuner. Okay, pretty cool stuff there. And then, oh, oh, I got a pink, pink polishing cloth. I think my other one was blue or black. Got a little polishing cloth there to keep your fingerprints off. Awesome. I got a blue one and I think a brown one last time, but uh, you get a couple Fesley picks. These are like really thick type picks too. They're they're not like, I would say they're over, easily over one mil. They might be one one point fives maybe. I don't know, but they're pretty pretty stout. They're not gonna not gonna wimp out on you really quickly. Let's put it that way. Okay, let's get right into it. Yeah. Okay. I like I like the black one, and uh, honestly, when I ordered the first time, I ended up getting the. Uh, purple first because well no actually i ordered the black first because there's only like two left at the time I'm like oh my god that's a popular one i gotta get it so i ordered that one and then luckily i had enough money and i thought you know what i'm gonna go ahead and get the purple one too because of you know i like purple <laughs> so let me just scooch on in here a little bit okay and of course you do get your all your tools here you need <laughs> And your wiggle stick. Gotta have your wiggle stick. Yeah. That's what it is. It's, uh, it's all it is. Yeah. That's it. Anyway. And then you get your other stuff here. Wait, how they got that rubber band on there? Ah, anyway. You get your other stuff. Your truss rod adjustment. All your intonation tools. All that good stuff there. So you get quite a bit of extra stuff. Uh, pretty cool. Alright. So let's go ahead and uh, look at this headstock here. Another nice headstock. This is pretty, this is identical to the purple one. I think they're just keeping it to where the headstocks are all black, which is kind of cool. And I like the way they got the Fesley on here. If you can see it in the light. It's, it's, it's like a gold. It's gold colored. That's pretty awesome. All right. So, then you got your, uh, you know, maple neck. Fesley branded tuners on the back. Okay. So let's go ahead, everybody ready. Everybody ready for the real. Come on, come on. Ah, yes! Yes, sir! Shh. Silence. Sorry. I get excited around here. Anyway, here we go. Three, two. I like that. It's black, but I would say it's more charcoal gray. 
You know what I mean? Just because of the way the, the flame is in it. Or, you know, it's lighter in the middle. That is sharp. I do like this guitar. I like it a lot. Let me get this uh, wax paper off here. And what did I do? Hey. 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 I need sugar, Jazz! I'm you know, I... There we are. Here. Here we are right here. I'm, I'm uh... Gonna go very gently. I, as soon as I figure out who took my uh, X-Acto knife, we're gonna have some problems. Okay? I'm gonna set that down before I scratch my uh, the finish or anything. Wow, this is sharp. All right. Take a look at that, guys. I like I love the lighting. The lighting's perfect. I'm trying to keep the big lights out of it so you can see the the actual colors of it and stuff. Look at that. And solid black back. You get the binding all the way around the body. Okay. Um, this is just like your, you know, kind of like your Fender Strat type of trim here. Like on the other one. You know, just goes flat to the body. Kind of nice. The action is pretty decent. Not bad. It's probably about where I'd have it, honestly. Uh, you have a maple veneer top. Poplar body. Um, it is a bolt on neck with the Fessley um, plate there. Pretty nice looking guitar, man. All right. Frets, uh, frets feel really good. There's, um, they're not sticking out at all. <laughs> Very impressive. Very impressive. Okay. All right. Let's get nerdy. I have my scale. Okay. We remember the other one, I believe, weighed 7.72 pounds. Let's just uh, see what this baby clock's in at. Ready? Okay, this one here is clocking in at a little lighter at 7.46. 7.46, so just, just around 7.5 pounds, roughly. Pretty nice guitar, man. Perfectly in tune, as I would expect. No, <laughs> just messing with you. But uh, yeah, five-way selector, volume, tone, tone. Really nice guitar. Really nice. I like the look of this. The purple one is beautiful, but there's just something about this blackish, like, charcoal gray. I really do like this. All right, guys, so real quick, let's go ahead and use this tool here to see if the neck is straight. And I have got it right there and right there. Perfectly done. This neck is spot freaking on, man. Freaking, I mean, come on, man. Can't I say something other than freaking? Can't I just say fuck? No? Sorry. Thought I could say fuck. So I can't say it? Alright. Anyway, uh, this neck is pretty spot on. Cool. Okay, let's get this tuner out, and uh, I'll, I'll uh, go through my tunings. <laughs> okay, we'll be right with you. Okay, guys, so I did try to tune this with the tuner. It didn't do too bad. Um, the high E was out just a little bit. Uh, it must be the intonation issue, which I'm not going to mess with that right now. But I think we got it sounding pretty good. <laughs> And, also, forgot, I started putting this on beforehand, the old uh, wiggle stick here. So, yeah, and this one here is a screw-in one, of course, but uh, if you remember in my very first uh, strat of these uh, Fessleys, the wiggle stick did not, like, it was, like, really loose. This one's just barely loose. It's better than it was, that's for sure. Uh, not nearly as noisy um, as the other one, and, um, yeah, so... Let's just go ahead. Oh, <laughs> yeah, good job. I almost forgot. <laughs> I almost forgot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Gotta have your finger ease, man. Finger ease. Hey, uh, whatever company this is, <laughs> I need some more. <laughs> Please. All right, guys, so we got everything ready to go. Let's just turn it up and uh, hear what we got. Fresh out. Ready? Let's just hit that uh, open D.
All right, here we go. That just sounds amazing. Uh, all I have is just a little bit of reverb on there. Ah, the low E went out just a little bit. Sorry. <laughs> it's staying in tune rather well. Uh, wow. God, man. Uh, these pickups are very, very articulate as the other one, uh, the purple. So, man, just sounds great. Let's uh, let's hit the old neck pickup. I got it right this time. Ha, neck pickup. Here we go. Ready? You got two different variations of the tone knob here. Let's turn them both back. Here's the bottom one raised up a little bit. I don't know. Hopefully I'm in the picture good. All right. So let's go with the, this would be both humbuckers here, I'm assuming, or single coils. <laughs> Where's the hammer? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> single coils. Slight tone difference there. A little bit. <laughs> anyway, all right, let's go to the middle. Um, the middle would be just the middle pickup. I think in the other video I was confused. Um, so, yeah, this would just be the middle pickup only in the middle position. <laughs> So this would be the middle and this oop, top part of the pickup here. And then the bridge. Let's take that E and drop it to D. Yeah, that way. Because if I say anything weird, you guys think it's messed up. So, <laughs> anyway. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see what we can do with the D here. It's always a G-string, man. Um, I don't think I told this before. Uh, they do have string trees at the top here. And I did say string trees. I don't know why it's hard for me to say string trees. Because I in, the lat in that one video, I said string tweez. But it's tree tweez. Trees. Trees. 
trees. Uh, let's just try to try to knock this out. Let's see how good these tuners actually are. Um, let's just uh, let's just go crazy, okay? Let's just try to do something stupid. This is ridiculous, man. For like 180 bucks after the coupon, if that's available still. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Best player ever. Best player. Right here. Right here. <laughs> Vote now.
All right, guys, there you go. That thing is beautiful. It sounds amazing. Um, I was trying to find out the fretboard material. It just says mixed materials. Um, not sure what that means. I know on their Les Paul models, they used, uh, I think it was Purple Heart uh, type of material, which I really liked. This isn't bad, uh, you know, plays well. Um, you see me doing some tapping. I'm not Eddie Van Halen by any way, but you know, when you can make those other strings ring out really well, um, I think that just shows the capability of the pickup and or the fretboard material, um, or maybe it's fingers, I don't know. But uh, yeah, all in all, an awesome guitar, man. Just crazy. Uh, yeah, I'll leave a link down below if you guys want to check it out. Hopefully that coupon's still available. Uh, like I said, it's $50 off, just like with the purple one. And I do have uh, the Sunburst and the blue one coming very soon. Um, I might do both of those in the same video, instead of dragging these out. Um, but yeah, check it out, dude. This thing is badass. Yeah, you ready? <laughs> you ready? Okay. Hey, check out my Stanger Shop. Why do you got to keep cutting me off, man? I just, I get tired of it. You know what I mean? All right, guys, if you like this video, drop a like down below. I really do appreciate it. Thank you to all my new subscribers. Thank you very much uh, for watching, subscribing, commenting, liking, whatever you're doing. Appreciate it, man. I really do. I'll see you guys in the next video very soon, okay? Rock on. Don't forget, it's all about the music. Later. Love you. Bye. Hey, guys, don't forget to check out my Stanger Shoppings. No, I wouldn't do anything. <laughs> it's just... No, I was just cleaning stuff up, man. Yeah, really, serious. Yeah, I just turned the camera off. <laughs> Sorry. Check it out. <clears throat>